Kentucky. It's breaking down how that could impact some of the college football and even high school football games around our region for tomorrow. Dante. A lot of big college football matchups here in the area this weekend and also some high school football we're going to take a look at as we get closer to the playoffs and into the playoffs as well for some of those games. The weather is definitely going to play a role in the matchups as we have some rain showers and also a few snowflakes in and around the area here. Kentucky hosting Vanderbilt for a 12 o'clock kickoff temperatures in the mid 30s with a few snowflakes. Not a lot of accumulation though it will mostly be rain especially by later on in the game. WVU Mountaineers hosting the Oklahoma Sooners for a 12 o'clock kickoff there. Mostly rain showers and temperatures in the mid 40s for that one. Ohio University will be playing Tuesday night and hosting Ball State for that Tuesday evening game. And we also have the Marshall Thundering Herd. A 3.30 kickoff hosting Appalachian State there and temperatures in the mid 40s with a few rain showers around. Very consistent temperatures throughout that one. And the Ohio State Buckeyes hosting the Indiana Hoosiers with a few snowflakes there early on in the game, changing the rain showers and temperatures in the lower 40s for that matchup. Let's take a look at those high school football matchups as well that we have as some of these games are moving into the playoffs now deep in the season. Jefferson at Spring Valley for temperatures in the 40s and a few rain showers. Logan at Winfield for a 1.30 p.m. kickoff. Weir at Roan County and also St. Mary's at Wahama for that nighttime game in the evening at 7.30 p.m. A few snowflakes for that one. Mostly rain showers, though, by the end. From the Eyewitness News Storm Team, I'm meteorologist Dante Ricky. Thank you, Dante. Well, former President Donald Trump is claiming he stopped Florida Governor